Well, today we're here in beautiful, as you can see, I hope, Beersheba. And this is Hadassah Park in Beersheba. And we'll be here for a couple of days in Beersheba. But what's so significant about Beersheba? The fact that Beersheba is the place where Abraham came. And, Ab and Beersheba means the place of seven wells. Or it also means a place of oath of an oath and you know Abraham made an oath with the people of the land uh, about the wells and about being able to live there here in the land of Canaan and but even more important God made not just an oath but a promise even greater than a promise a covenant with Abraham and he said that Abraham would be more numerous his seed would be more numerous than the stars of the heavens than the sands of the seashores and we can see that is exactly what has happened and so we're waving our banners unto the Lord you, you may wonder why do we wave the banners well in Psalm chapter 20 it gives you the answer to that it says may we sing for joy at your salvation and you know, if you take that word salvation back into the original language, the Hebrew language, that word is Yeshua. <laughs> so the very name of Yeshua, Jesus, is in that psalm. And it says, and we will raise our banners in the name of our God. So there again, he speaks of the name. The name of our God is Yeshua. And so we're waving our banners right here in Beersheba where the oath and the promises were made to Abraham but not just to Abraham because we have inherited the faith of Abraham if we just but believe God did everything that he said he d did would do and is going to do and if we believe that we are part of that covenant with Abraham so it's a beautiful day to remember that as here we are in Beersheba somewhere in this vicinity to imagine that God met with Abraham and made these promises with him and we have that same promise for us because you know the book of Romans tells us that we didn't replace Israel we didn't come along and and take their promises away from them no we were grafted into the olive tree a picture of Israel we were grafted in as a wild olive branch and now we have those same rights and privileges and promises that God promised to Abraham what a beautiful thing to remember and so yes we wave our banners unto the Lord because basically what we're doing is we're poking a hole in the atmosphere and we're challenging the enemy and we're saying we are here we are claiming this beautiful place for the Lord our God. It's already His, but we're telling Him, come back, Lord. Come back to this place. Come back to your land. We welcome you here. Come back to this land and rule and reign for us. You are our eternal King, and we give you praise in the mighty name of Yeshua HaMashiach. God bless you all.